The FarmerGuard PR797 may include waste disposal containers beneath the work surface. It is recommended the isolator be left running to flush the work area with clean air during the replacement of a waste receptacle. Lift the waste chute cover from the work surface and unscrew the post. Set the post aside and place the waste chute cover back over the work surface. Turn the locking handles beneath the isolator counterclockwise to release the container from the waste chute gasket. If this is a Sharps container, seal the transport lid and dispose of according to your facility's standard operating procedures. Plastic bags may be used with the waste container as needed according to SOP. Apply even pressure to the container's lid to lock it into place. Place the sealed containers aside and place a new one on the waste receptacle tray beneath the isolator. Remove the filler cap from the mouth of the container and raise the tray back into its original position. Ensure the neck of the container is fully sealed within the waste receptacle chute gasket before locking the tray into place. Finally, screw the post back into the waste chute cover and put it back into place.